The Roman and Sassanid empires are at war. The Roman Emperor Justinian has appointed the young Belisarius as commander of his army in the east. Belisarius must reverse the tide of the war, which has been moving against the Romans. He is fortifying the city of Dara, which lies close to the enemy border. The Sassanids have sent an army under Perozzes to stop him. Outnumbered, the Romans have dug a trench before the walls to aid the city's defense. Perozzes has sent word to Belisarius that a bath should be prepared for him in the city. The Romans know, therefore, that battle will soon be upon them. Man the trenches, men! The enemy advance! The advance of the enemy is my greatest concern if this takes and this ditch. So, where are my spearmen? That's one, that's two. I have you there, and I have you. I'm gonna go in detail soon. Not that, not that I probably like it, but you know, anyway. You know me. I still bad believe I even if I don't have to. Actually I'm quite quite, <coughs> quite quiet. You may have realized actually. Uh no, I don't want you open. So yeah, draw me a bath Dara. The AI. It's not going for a frontal assault, at least. That's historically incorrect. But... I guess... Uh, <clears throat> I guess the uh, modern total war ain't that... Uh, what, should, what should you say? Into the details, but... You know, it, it's nice. Oh, shit. Yeah, I'm way slow air, but then again, they are charging. Why not you off? Yeah, I'm sorry guys, I'm gonna have to remove some stuff I don't need on this PC. Believe me, that's quite a lot. Um. <laughs> yeah, like, way too much. Uh, let's see. So yeah, draw me a bath in the city of Dara, and, and this ditch actually w went al along a good way out, you know, like... Okay, I don't have anything to draw with, but, you know, a good way out, at least. You know, it was flanked by two mountains, as far as I know. And uh, the AI, I'm uh, not the AI. I don't remember their name, his name, let's see. Whatever. Uh, Pet, Peros, something. Ness <coughs> said that, yeah, draw me a bath. Well, sadly, I had to go home quite dirty, I guess. So yeah, um, yeah, I'm focusing on fighting the battle. That's why I have a little problem. Okay, about half. Um, not that much actually. 
when I do so. Move you. So. So yeah, I read the news. Most of you probably read it already that <coughs> the Warhammer Told War being moved forward. But now we are in a historical battle in Attila. So Belisarius, you all know who that is? No. Well, that's the guy that's mentioned in uh, oh, what's the DLC named? The last Roman. Yeah, this is he's the last of the Romans. And here we have the. I don't know who those are, but yeah, he's he's considered <coughs> considered the last of the Romans, and uh, the Western Rome have already <coughs> already fallen. So this is this is before rise and <coughs> the last of the Romans. I don't know why I keep mixing that up. Last of <coughs> the Romans. And I think that's historical incorrect, but anyway, so yeah, the Romans <coughs> haven't lost them. They won, my bad. Fuck me, did I? Uh, but yeah, the, the Sassanids went along to attack <coughs> get the right side of the ditch that was flanked by a mountain, and that caused a Roman <coughs> cavalry ambush. And drive them off the field. And the same, almost the same story was repeated in the on the <coughs> western side, which is the left side. Only so that there, then were just lured away. You know, <coughs> the Sassanids ain't known for their infantry. So uh, when the inf <coughs> the cavalry was gone. Guess who had to charge across the ditch? That was a way, a bit way out and quite deep. The infantry had to. And if I'm not wrong, I'm gonna enter quite soon. If you not <clears throat> don't know, someone with a lot of armor and quite professional with wielding a sword or a spear. We'll easily cut down, see if we can get a good close in, one of these. We've got a decent shield, a decent sword, but you know, no armor. You know, probably there just make us numbers. Those are the guys who are gonna charge off this wall. Did I say charge off? Charge up this wall, and climb over the wall, and do stuff. So yeah, once the, those guys, <coughs> once the cavalry is gone, the infantry get the killing blow by the Romans. Yes. <coughs> Romans and that's it, really. The Sassanids lose the battle and Pyrrhus, I don't know. Croesus doesn't get his buff, and also bring a lot of shame to himself. Actually, let's be a little humid today, and let's just do like the Spartans do: kill those who stand against us. This is not a campaign campaign, so I can afford it. Even though it's quite sad to see them run away. And of course, this brings a lot of glory to Belisarius, who you all know will probably be a faction leader in the last, uh, in the last Romans. So yeah, I guess that sums it up, really. The enemy retreat in disarray. The battle is ours. This was quite an easy battle, but I guess if you raise the difficulty. It's gonna be a different story. Good, be good. We are moments away from victory. So yeah, I will cut, <clears throat> write down in the description below a little more about the. Uh, I probably should have done this <laughs> in the beginning of the video, but I'm gonna give some more info on the battle in the description below. 
I hope you all enjoyed. I most certainly did. After all, I won. Big surprise there. So, uh, just gonna show you the results. Of course, is this the first time I've fight with the Eastern? No, it's not. I'm quite sure it ain't. But yeah, I hope you all enjoyed. That was quite 50 50. And I see you guys in the next battle. Enjoy.